Hey guys, how's everyone doing? Welcome back to my channel. This is Sonam. Today we are going to talk about nursing. Yay! As you can probably tell by the title of this video, we are going to talk about five things nurses must have in their hands or on them at all times when they're at work. Instead of focusing more on what we need as nurses to care for our patients, we're going to drift away from that and we're going to discuss about things that nurses must have in order to keep them going and keep them on their toes at work and away from health issues because we are nurses. We have to care for ourselves before we care for others. And so without any further delays, let's just get into the video. So first thing that we need is something very basic. Even if you're not a nurse, you should always have this essential, which is very basic. It's a water bottle. You must have a water bottle. As nurses, we are always busy. We're with patients, we're talking to the family members, we are always busy and it's so important to look for a water bottle which can really be quick and easy to drink from like a water bottle like this one i'm not promoting anything here i found out about this water bottle from my friend you can get this at costco on amazon i'll probably link everything down below but this water bottle it's not hydro flask so it's not like high maintenance water bottle like if i drop it i'm not gonna really like give a damn you know when you look for a water bottle you should always look for a water bottle that you can easily drink from and you won't have to open it like you know this thing takes a lot of time this is a lot of time for a nurse to do like patient can die when well <laughs> I'm going a little too far here but really honestly it's so important to have a water bottle that you can just easily grab and just drink and go trust me guys it was so hard for me to find a water bottle that I enjoyed drinking from until I found this one and thanks to my friend and it's amazing how a water bottle that does not have a straw can make huge difference in you not grabbing that water bottle uh, at work and it has happened to me a lot but ever since I got this water bottle I've been drinking a lot more water at work and I also take it to the gym this is amazing like it's like I've dropped this water bottle many times um, as you can tell here there's some like you know things going on down there but uh, there's no leakage um, the straw can go up and it can go down as well obviously it's also got a handle which you can just use to carry it around at work and uh, make sure with water bottle don't keep it in the bag whenever you get to work get in the habit of taking the water bottle out and putting it somewhere where you can easily reach uh, you can put it in nursing station you can put it in the pantry a place where you're constantly at so that you can just see it and drink it on top of that it's always good to choose a water bottle with a color that is like very visible to your eyes if it's like a black water bottle I'm sure it's not going to make you drink as much water as a color like this one which is like turquoise I think so yeah uh, that's number one number two is a very important this is also health related for nurses number two is socks and these are compression socks these come in a longer version because it goes up to your knees and it really helps compress the legs uh, because nurses are always standing on their feet and when you're standing for a long period of time it could be 8 hours for me and for others it is 12 hours and 12 hours is a very long shift imagine yourself standing for like 10 hours it's not really good for you if you're always standing or always sitting for those of you guys who are working on your laptop or in the office it's 
so important to buy compression socks for yourself trust me it's really gonna help with the swelling issues and leg pain when you get home from a long shift quick tip for nurses uh, to reduce swelling or if you have leg pain uh, after a long period of hours of standing lay down on the bed and keep your legs up on the wall for about five to ten minutes uh, that really helps with reducing swelling and also the pain or soreness that we get from standing uh, for a long period of time yeah so that is very essential the third thing that we as nurses need is snacks that you can bite on easily and just carry on with your work sometimes you don't get to sit down and just eat a good meal which can then not be too healthy for nurses um, maybe it's good for me because I need to lose some weight but you need to have some energy in order to work try to take healthy snacks that will give you energy and that'll give you the boost to like continue to work if you eat chips and if you eat um, like snacks with like high carbs and things like that it's only gonna make you like get more tired so uh, things like carrots um, put it in a ziploc it's the easiest way to go um, and keep it somewhere just like the water bottle near you so that you can just reach easily and eat them as you go I guess make sure you wash your hands before you eat them also because most nurses have no time to wash their hands also but it's so important because you don't want to get sick you can also take bars which are really healthy um, there are bars that have a lot of sugar in them like made of chocolate and sugar and whatnot i don't that is one thing that i don't understand about snack bars they make snack bars sound so healthy but then when you actually look at the ingredients they're not very healthy there's a lot of sugar lots of chocolate like way too much peanut butter and things like that so i honestly don't rely much on um snack bars but yeah man you should take bananas um oranges that is what i take i take oranges i take bananas i take um apples uh, i'm not a huge fan of apples but sometimes when i feel like having it i have it i mostly take fruits like real fruits not like you know snack bars or um things that are like processed always try to like stay on the healthier side when you're choosing your snacks because that is the one that will give you the energy when you don't get to eat a proper meal at work so that's number three uh number four i don't know anymore guys this topic just came in my mind and i just like started to shoot the video i don't even know if i'm gonna post it so if i post it yay um because like i really want to do like different things i really want to do like different videos that can really help people instead of just uh doing vlogs every time number four is not really related to health but um it kind of it kind of is number four is scrubs it is so important to have comfortable scrubs that'll keep you going throughout your shift if you have scrubs that have really long v-neck cut you don't want to be that nurse who's constantly like pulling your scrub top because it's always falling down uh, mind you nurses have to carry their stethoscope nurses have tons of stuff in their pockets if you can go and put your hand into a nurse's pocket like you'll find all kinds of stuff you'll find gloves you'll find you'll find pens like tons of pens markers highlighters you'll find alcohol pads uh, you'll find your lip balm which you never get to put on a lot of things and so you don't want a scrub top which will always go down on you and you always have to constantly take time to pull it up and same goes with pants you want comfortable and stretchy pants good enough to keep your tushy from showing from behind when you're bending down because as nurses we have to bend sometimes and so when scrubs are 
uncomfortable you just the day just doesn't go well that's what happens to me when I'm not wearing a comfortable scrub and when you're busy you don't have time to pull up your pants pull up your uh, scrub top when things are comfortable it's always gonna make you feel better so when you have good scrubs you'll be more engaged at work people won't find you pulling up your pants all the time you know what i mean so that is that last but not the least number five that is you guys probably know say it with me <laughs> You guys probably guessed this one right because I didn't mention it earlier but good working shoes is so freaking important for nurses. I don't know about other nurses but there are people in this world who are nurses who have wide feet, who have problem with finding uh, good comfortable shoes and that is me. Um, I have wide feet. Most of my regular shoes that I've worn at work are not that comfortable when it comes to standing for a long period of time but i found a good shoes that really kept me going and i've mentioned it in my vlog last time those are the um new balance i'll let you know about the specific type of new balance shoes that i have but those are really comfortable i was surprised when i wore them to work and i was like oh my god this shoes is really good for the price that i paid i only paid like 50 dollars for this shoes but this shoes is the shoes for me and so if you guys are looking for good comfortable shoes try that shoes i know people try like dansky um scrub shoes and things like that but i don't find them comfortable i had one pair of uh, scrub shoes uh but it wasn't from dansky uh but i did not like it because it was the sole was so hard that when i was standing like you could feel the hardness of the sole on your feet and I, I don't want to feel that you know like it's it's just not comfortable for me so Dansky is a no-no for me but yeah try the new balance I'll uh, link it down below if I find it so guys that is it for the five essentials that nurses must have in order to keep yourself healthy and keep you going right so on that note i'm going to wrap this up i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you do don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed subscribe to my channel i try to post a video every sunday mind you i am a full-time nurse and so i try to fit everything in perfectly so that everything will be in a timely manner thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys next sunday bye